Hello scientific people, how are you today? I am back with a very interesting question, which object will melt first? So guys, we have a situation where we have two objects A and B. Melting point of A is minus 10 degree Celsius. Melting point of B is minus 5 degree Celsius. Now, suppose they are in inside different refrigerators this is a deep freezer compartment and I am placing A inside it this is deep freezer compartment of the another refrigerator I am putting B inside it so inside this refrigerator the temperature is slightly below the melting points let's consider as minus 11 degree so this object is not going to melt inside this refrigerator now here the melting point is minus 5 degree celsius and inside this deep freezer compartment the melting point say for example the temperature is minus 6 degree celsius so these two are not going to melt inside the refrigerators now what am i doing is i am removing these two objects from the refrigerators and I am placing them over here together so A and B both are placed together outside in the open where the temperature is 27 degree Celsius so A melting point is minus 10 degree Celsius B melting point is minus 5 degree Celsius which object is going to melt first guys even I felt this problem to be quite difficult but I had to research a lot and then finally I came up with this answer and I was quite satisfied this, with, with, with my answer and that's why I am sharing this video with you. I felt that this is the answer to the problem that what happens is here the difference in the temperature is quite less 27 to minus 5 so the difference over here is about 32 degree Celsius. I mean I am taking the difference between these two and here the difference between these two is 37 degree Celsius you can we can see that the difference in the temperature is larger so heat energy always flow from high temperature to low temperature so from the atmosphere the heat energy will go in B also from the atmosphere the heat energy will go in A also now both of them suppose just suppose both of them they require equal amount of heat for melting this is not very true but just consider that out these both they require same amount of heat energy for melting so which object will gather the heat energy faster is a it's because the difference in the temperature is larger so the heat energy always will flow from high temperature to low temperature faster if the difference in the temperature is larger so that means a is going to gather heat required for melting faster compared to b so a object is going to melt faster compared to b we also cannot ignore the fact that latent heat of fusion We cannot ignore the fact about latent heat of fusion also. It might be possible that A and B are not having different, are not having same latent heat of fusion. If A has got more latent heat of fusion than B, then but obviously guys, even though it has got less melting point, this object may require longer time to get melt. So our answer to this problem is, is quite simple if we ignore this fact both of them out of them those substances which has got lower melting point will melt faster because the difference in the temperature is larger so the heat energy gathered by a would be more faster and more quickly compared to b so a will melt faster than b but if we consider this fact then we need perfect datas that what is the latent heat of a and what is the latent heat of b if the latent heat of a is very very larger than the latent heat of b then even though the melting point is less the a would require more time to melt compared to that of b so guys 
hopefully you like my explanation and if you have not subscribed my channel please do that and definitely share your views about this video as well thank you guys